and then SPF of course you know for the day and vitamin C my vitamin C drops you know vitamin C drops moisturizer tretinoin cleanser SPF it's a five thing okay and then I don't do tretinoin during the day I do that at night and then SPF during the day are you supposed to cleanse every day I do I don't know how some people can just take their makeup off with wipes okay I don't know how um, I'm wearing the merit blush in mood and then um, I kind of put some of this on the Dior rosy glow what cleanser I like Avita. I like their brand a lot and I have their under eye mask it's also really good oh it's I thought that was the under eye mask. Wait, where is my under eye mask? I just dropped it. Mm -mm. I really like this one. I just, it's so good. Is the Dior blush worth it? No, it's too expensive for what it is. I feel like MAC has really good blushes. I really like MAC's blushes to be honest. And you can definitely find a shade like that for MAC. And it'll be just as pigmented, pigmented if not more. Um, I know, I know. The Dior concealer is way too good. It's not okay. It is way too good. It's bad. Um, is it true that Arabic men are controlling, possessive, I'm Persian, and want everyone? Yeah, they're basically like Persian men. They're not gonna like hearing that, but basically, they're just different types of crazy though. Like Lebanese crazy is different than Persian crazy, like. Not that anyone's better than the other, they're just different styles. You know, different different techniques of trauma are used. <laughs> um, I use the dry bar heat protectant. Y'all, they bombed Yaman today. Um... Well, kind of crazy so I would say like to be honest with you it's just different how do I say like okay I feel like Persian men just will like yell Lebanese men will ghost you know what I'm saying it's like different styles of trauma like I'm telling you it's not okay um and then the Lebanese man will come back and insult you like really badly um yeah, like, that's kind of how they, that's their tactic. <laughs> Are you Muslim? Yes. Oh, shit. That's crazy. I'm gonna look it up on oh, my phone. Where's my phone at? I mean, I'm 26 now, so, you know. That sounds scary. Mm. Have you gone into KPD? I feel like they have the best stuff. I haven't yet, but I was just talking about this today. Like, I wish there were stores that sell KPD. I don't feel like there's a lot of stores selling KPD. It's the U.S. and the U.K. that are doing it.
Okay, sorry, I just started reading an article. And there we are. Yeah, Saudi Arabia. Wow, what a shocker. <laughs> like, who would have thought they would never do that? I live in Colorado. Is liking stories cheating? Yeah. Like, what is he liking stories of a girl? Cute, what did he like about it? You should ask him, like, what was your favorite part? <laughs> no, thank you. Uh, what's your ideal ethnicity type? Middle Eastern. No. Oh. Just keep it simple. Any recommendations, like food recommendations? Um, food of Denver, Colorado does not have a good food scene. Like, if you live in Colorado, you know this. But, um, yeah, I'm from Denver. But, you know, like, just letting you know. I like Edge in downtown Denver. It's pretty good. And they have really good pokey. What if someone is saying, and they have other foods. It's not, like, but I just, specifically, I was surprised because I don't like pokey, but I like it from there. Actually, I should go there soon. My nails are so ugly, I had to, you know, file them down. Oh, that's fun. Or anything. Um, let me think. Um, I would go, go to the Cherry Creek area. It's really nice. Um, there's like a shopping center and then you can walk outside like Cherry Creek North where they have all these restaurants and stuff. Um, there's Meow Wolf if you're into that. I'm not really that kind of person. But you know, if you are, um, that's, <laughs> that's it. You can hang out downtown Denver if you want, you know. Yeah, I live in Colorado. Of course it does. Of course, his nose. <laughs> he was trying. <laughs> yes, I've been to Aspen before. I've. I'm not. I'm not sure. You know what I actually do like doing though. Like I like escape rooms. Escape rooms are so much fun. Um, like, especially when you go with a group. I don't know. I've had a lot of good memories in escape rooms. <laughs> yeah. Why are nice men not enough for me? Because you don't respect yourself, so you get weirded out when someone respects you. My family is safe in Lebanon, alhamdulillah. Why Colorado? Like, I grew up here, so... That's kind of how it happened. I'm 26. My mom's side is Lebanese. Um. Future career plans? I wanna open up my own practice, dentistry practice. What do you do for fun hobbies? I like to shop. <laughs> that is so embarrassing. I don't know. That's it. And I like to work out. Like now I'm into weightlifting. That's a hobby right there. Um, I haven't been very consistent with it recently just because, you know, I'm really busy. But I try to, like I get, right now I'm just doing two days a week. I'm going to be honest with you, okay? I was at four days a week to two days. All right. So that's where we're at right now. I've lost so much weight though. Like I don't have an appetite. I haven't had an appetite. So... You know, thankfully for that. <laughs> so yeah, that's helped me. I worked at a histology lab. What made you want to do weightlifting? Because I wanted to get really toned and build muscle. So, like, I know when people think about weightlifting, they think like getting big and bulky, but I just want to do it for toning purposes. You know, like even Victoria's Secret models, like they do weightlifting, but you know what I'm saying? You don't necessarily have to hit, like, like lift really heavy either. Um, no, I'm not trying to look like Wonder Woman. Like, look, I have, like, a little mini bump. That's it. Look how much smaller it's gone, though. But, like, that's it. That's what I want, you know? 
Um, do I recommend not? Yeah, honestly, there's some that do. Just be careful because some use, use y'all, <laughs> you know. But yeah, of course, there's some that do. Aw, oh, thank you, Yasi. Yazi. Yeah, like I said, I've only been working out two days a week, so I just have no appetite because I haven't been working out. Um, I've been so stressed and busy, you know. Um, like, they use you guys for pleasure, and then, you know, then you find out he's with his cousin back home. You know what I mean? Like, watch out for those. Watch out for those names. I want to go up where to begin. Um, I would say figure out like a style you like. And then it can be with clothes that are in your closet. You don't have to like start over. There's some things you should probably get rid of, but you know, and then get pieces that like, it's going to look good five years from now. I'm just being honest. Okay. That's why everything I wear is very basic. I understand. I mean, you're allowed to get something crazy every once in a while and you know, that's fine, but just get some stuff that don't go out of style oh you can scream if you saw my closet do you highlight your cubits though no actually i don't oh that's um that's my lip balm i think it's like listening good as you should brooke booker <laughs> i don't know why it's just i saw b in a k and i was like that's brooke <laughs> Do you buy from Lululemon? I do. I'm wearing Lululemon leggings.